hello everyone how to simplify this nice algebraic expression so if we have 5 to the power of 7 minus 6 we write this expression into the simplified form but here you remember one thing is that calculator is not allowed in this problem also we can solve this problem without using the calculator and here we will show all of the working on this page so here uh, the very first step we are going to do is first uh, we need to focus on the exponent of this term and its exponent is 7 and we break this 7 and we write it as 5 to the power of 6 plus 1 minus this is our 6 so here we need an exponent law you know that if we have a to the power of m plus n it is equals to a to the power of m multiplied by a to the power of n so here according to this exponent law uh, we need to break this exponent and we write it as 5 to the power of 6 multiplied by 5 to the power of 1 minus 6 so now we need to focus on this 6 and we break this 6 as in this form 5 to the power of 6 multiplied by 5 to the power of 1 minus we write this 6 as minus 5 minus 1 because minus 5 minus 1 equals to minus 6 and now in the next step you see here we have 5 be the common term then we take common 5 from the first two terms and the remaining terms are 5 to the power of 6 and here you have minus 1 and this is our minus 1 and now our next target is to find uh, first the value of uh, uh, 5 to the power of 6 so that now here in order to find the value of 5 to the power of 6 we will first just simplify this 5 to the power of 6 and now we take a 5 to the power of 6 and we write it as uh, we write this uh, 5 to the power of 6 as 5 to the power of 2 multiplied by 3 we know that 2 multiplied by 3 equals to 5 to the power of 6 and here we will apply the exponent law you know if we have a to the power of m times of n it is equals to a to the power of m to the power of n so now according to this uh, rule uh, we just write this expression as in this form 5 to the power of 6 equals to 5 to the power of 3 and its whole square so now you see here uh, the 5 to the power of 3 means that if you have a square we write it as a times of a so here according to this rule we break this 5 to the power of 3 square as in this form it will be written as 5 to the power of 3 multiplied by 5 to the power of 3 and now here in the next step we need to find the product of 5 to the power of 3 so you know that uh, the meaning of 5 to the power of 3 is that we will multiply 5 uh, with 5 times so here you see that 5 5s are 25 and multiplied by 5 so 25 times of 5 becomes 125 it means that uh, 5 to the power of 3 equals to 125 uh, so now we replace it here this is 125 multiplied by 125 and now we again break this value and we write it as this is 125 we write this 125 as uh, 100 plus 20 and plus 5 okay here i can just break uh, this value in smallest form so that uh, we need simplification without using the calculator so that i can convert this question in that situation in which we can easily multiply or easily simplify that question or that step okay so that we will break this into the most uh, simplified form or more simplest form okay so that now you see here if you can multiply 125 by 100 then you can just put these two zeros here it will be written as 1 to 5 and double zero similarly when you need to multiply 125 by 20 you just multiply 125 by 2 uh, then you will obtain here 250 and we can write this zero here and plus 125 plus 5 
equals to 625 okay here uh, we will first find the value of 5 to the power of 6 and now at the last we need to uh, sum up uh, all these three values so here we will uh, use the traditional method of addition in order to sum up these values so you see here uh, we will just add these values in this method so this is our 5 this is our 2 this is 5 plus 5 10 10 plus 6 16 we write 6 and carry 1 this is 2 plus 2 4 4 plus 1 is 5 and this is over 1 so it means that our the value of 5 to the power of 6 equals to 1 5 6 and 2 5 okay so now here uh, we need to put this value on this equation so that this equation is implies that here we will just put the value of 5 to the power of 6 okay so we write it as uh, this is 5 times of 5 to the power of 6 so the value of 5 to the power of 6 is 1 5 6 2 5 minus 1 and this is also subtracted by minus 1 okay so here uh, we need to uh, simplify uh, this equation so when you can uh, subtract this uh, uh, 115,625 by 1 it is equals to 15,624 and this is minus 1. So now here we need to multiply 5 by this value. So uh, we can just multiply it by traditional method of multiplication and it will be written as 1, 5, 6, 2, 4 and it is multiplied by 5. So here uh, you have 5 4 is a 20, we write 0 carry 2, 5 2 is a 10, 10 plus 2 12, and we write 2 and carry 1, 5 6 is a 30, 30 plus 1 31, we write 1 and carry 3, 5 5 is a 25, 25 plus 3 28, we write 8 carry 2, 5 1 is a 5 plus 2 becomes 7, so here we get uh, 78,120 uh, so we will write it here 78,120 and this is our minus 1 so further uh, in the next step we need to subtract it by minus 1 so we have this is the value we can subtract it by minus 1 here so you see that uh, here we need to take common uh, 1 and this will become 10 10 minus 1 is 9 this is 1 this is 1 8 and 7 so uh, finally we have uh, the value of this number is 7 8 1 1 and 9 so finally we have 5 to the power of 7 minus 6 equals to 78119 this is the our final answer of this question and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos